All right, welcome back. Sunday's Mother's Day, and Kevin Carr is back uh, from FatGuysAtTheMovies.com joining us. Kevin yeah. has picked, and he's very good at this, t picked the top five mom movies of all time. Yeah. This is from Kevin Carr's mind, but he knows movies. Yeah, may not necessarily be the movies you're going to take your mom to see. <laughs> right. Some of these aren't exactly endearing, but they're definitely about a mom, yeah. uh, like it or not. Number five, Mr. Mom with Michael Keaton and Terry Garr. What a classic. It is a great movie, and the thing is, it's, it's very close to my heart because I take care of my kids. Yeah, you are a Mr. Mom. I am a Mr. Mom. So uh, it, it is kind of fun to watch again and, and see all the all the things. And it, and it is a sort of out of its out of its element in the sense that now it's a little more common to have guys that stay at home with their kids. But it was a great way to just sort of bust some of those gender stereotypes back in the 80s. Back in the 80s. I think it was early 80s that came out. That mm -hmm. really was very unique that a dad would actually yeah. stay home with the kids. Oh, and he was watching soap operas and clipping coupons sure and that was. sort of thing. With um, other moms in the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. So, Mr. Mom, a great choice yeah. uh, as we look at the top five mom movies of all time. Number four, Throw Mama from the Train with Danny DeVito. Not a lot of love here, but it's a great story. It's a fantastic movie, and it's it's so well directed and so funny. And the mom is so horrible <laughs> but she's she but he loves her so much and that's what i think's to, to a real real take home from this in that <laughs> that no matter what your mom does you're always going to love her for something yeah you, you love her even if you don't get along with her if understand you want to throw her, her from a train you want to throw her up a moving train <laughs> you always love your mom all right number three uh probably the biggest surprise on the list oh, i should have known psycho <laughs> norman bates yeah okay Explain. Well, it's just a sweet little story about yeah. a guy who loves his mom so much, yeah. he will do anything for her. Oh, yeah. He it, will. It's, it's the most classic, uh, most famous mother in movie history. Oh, there's probably. the shower scene. Yeah, but mm -hmm. it's, it's, a great, it's a great little film. And, uh, <laughs> but I think it, 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 if you think mom, when I think mom, I think psycho. I think psycho. Nothing against my mom. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, mom. Oh, yeah, she's not watching. <laughs> oh, she's All right. watching. <laughs> Number two from Psycho to really an endearing movie uh, with a mother, uh, Bambi. Yeah. Now, Bambi's mother, of course, did not last very long, right? She died yeah. early on. Yeah. What made you think mom? Well, because it's, it is it is a movie that begins with the birth of Bambi and with his mom. And it is the story of a mother's love. And, and it's a little bit of an odd choice because not everyone's going to put it on their list because they're going to put stuff like Stepmom or, right. or, or some classic films. But it is, it, it is a movie about what a mother can do for her, her kid. Whether you're an animal or a human or that sort of thing. Well, and I, everyone, when you say Bambi, what's the first thing people to say? Bambi's mom. Okay. Good. I'll buy it. And the number one mom movie, according to Kevin Carr, incidentally, one of the best movies of all time that has no mothers in it, The Sound of Music. Yes. Well, she becomes a mother. She because becomes her stepmother. She becomes her stepmother. And, and it is a story of, uh, it, it's a classic story. It still holds up today. Just recently came out on Blu-ray. It looks beautiful. And it's got such great music. It's got a great story. And it is the story of a person uh, who becomes the mother, who becomes the loving parent who, who brings the kids into a fold. And, and for stepmoms everywhere, such a difficult job sometimes to come into a family. and. Uh, well, and if you look how stepmoms are often portrayed in movies. This is, that's right. They are portrayed that's absolutely. as bad people. Look at but, Cinderella. Yeah, exactly. But this one, <laughs> it shows it's a very positive thing. So, yeah, it's a good mom. How you didn't include Mommy Dearest in your <laughs> list, uh, in Kevin Carr's list, I don't know. Did you think about Mommy Dearest? I did think, but I said, well, I got Psycho on there. <laughs> I can't throw down Mommy Dearest, Another too. horrible movie about her. My horrible. mom will never babysit for me again if, <laughs> if I did that. Your mom will never speak to you again after comparing her to Psycho. <laughs> I didn't do that. All right, Kevin Carr, FatGuysAtTheMovies.com, thanks. Thank you. I think it's great.